first impression was just how nice it looked. I was a bit apprehensive about, is it gonna fit properly? You know, have we got the socket right? You know, when you've waited, you build, you build it up, be the best thing in, in, the, in the world. I think there was an element of, of hope on the way in, and then the expectations were exactly what I was hoping for. So, you know, that was just great. When I was a young lad, a mate at the time had joined the military, so I thought, I'll give it a go. Unfortunately, on, on one of the numerous operational tours that I'd done, I was in Afghanistan in 2008, had a, an incident with a mortar ammunition, 81mm mortar, um, which resulted in me losing my right arm below the elbow. After going past the, the, the worry of if you're going to survive and, and how the future is going to be, you just immerse yourself into rehabilitation. You know, the biggest part of the whole journey was that, you know, I had a, I had a great career, loved my career in the military. The injury at, at the point I left was, was no longer an injury, it was just me. You know, I wasn't Daz with one arm, I was just Daz. It means a great deal to actually have an electric arm that now that I can use, it's, it's the functionality that I'm hoping to get from it and the things that I can do. The more I can do with my right arm, the longer it's gonna save my left. I mean, at the minute I do, way too much with my left, sometimes it aches. I'm hoping that by having this and the functionality this is gonna give me, will extend the longevity of the left, which means I, you know, I can do a lot more going into my, into my later years. I'm relatively confident, you know, without wearing any prosthetic, but it will give me the, the confidence to, to try things with the prosthetic, whereas before I probably wouldn't even bother to try, and that, that confidence will, will transpire in other parts of your life. You now, to be the first veteran to to get one, I mean, it's fantastic, but it it, it leads it leads on to hopefully me being the first of many. That's that's what I want. Mm -hmm.